On March 5th in Waimea, Mayor Billy Kanoi gave an update on the renovations at Mauna Kea Recreation Area. The state turned over management of the scenic spot on Saddle Road to the county on July 1st, 2014, and already big changes can be seen. Talk about our team's great work at Mauna Kea. I want to thank the Waimea community, a member association, our elected officials. Um, who helped transfer that. For six years, I would go up to the state legislature every year and say, hey, aloha state, why not give us hapuna in Mauna Kea? Because people don't care county or state, they just like them nice. And every, you know, I, I put on three, 4,000 miles a month and everybody driving back and forth. And you go Mauna Kea, no more sink, no more rubbish can. You know, and you're like, wow, no more sink, no more clean toilet. So finally, after six years, I want to thank Patty and the Waimea community for the advocacy, Senator Malama Solomon. Oh, when you let her loose, boy. People just gave us the park for tell her, stop coming, bothering them. But, <laughs> um, but we got them, and Warren guy, public works go up all in-house, redo the whole parking lot now. Parks and Rec went in, our own plumbers, electricians. July 1st, we took care of First thing we did was put up flags for honor our veterans and those who serve. And we're building a new bathroom, so no such thing as no more bathrooms, no matter how many people need, build for the future. We're not pl playground, we're gonna go in. Um, and then we're gonna turn to the cabins in the back. But I hope people, when they drive by now, they feel clean, safe, nice. Um, I would love to enter into more agreements with the state to transfer more. Not saying, hey, the county can do them better or the county, you know, get more money, which we don't. But we live here. We experience this stuff every day. Um, so I think it's important, you're right, not just to build, but we want to be able to have the capacity to maintain. So whereas before, uh, so we get these two committees. One's called an expenditure review committee and one's called a staffing review committee. That's to ensure that every position and every expenditure uh, is necessary and needed. And so that's our commitment to make sure that we can take care of it and not just have it. So thanks for your question. Aloha.